Hey, what's up everyone? Alex here, and I wanted to show off my uh, tea box, is what I call it. It is uh, the box that has all of my testosterone supplies in it. Um, so if needles bother you, then um, please don't uh, watch, obviously. But I have this box um, that I keep my needles and all my supplies for doing my weekly testosterone injections. And I wanted to do kind of like a little tour of it. Um, I actually have my testosterone. I don't want to give a give away like too much of my like counter space in the bathroom here um sorry for the audio but i'm in a bathroom so um you can also probably hear the rain hitting the uh the house and whatnot so that's a thing but i have my testosterone here sometimes it's inside this box but um i have it out right now um but i have this lock box that I've just kind of slammed down there. Um, usually I have more needles in here, but I haven't refilled this <laughs> in a while. Um, so basically I just keep my alcohol swabs in here. Um, there's supposed to be band-aids in here. So pretend there's band-aids right here. Um, I've got my needles. Well, the syringes, the needles are up here. Um, I have them in pairs because one of them is for, the gray one is for taking the testosterone out of the bottle. The blue one is for injecting. So they're two different gauges. If you like, if you know like body mod stuff, you know, like needles come in sizes of like gauges. This is really hard to do with one hand. Okay. Um, and usually I keep a bottle of testosterone in this, these little zipper pouches, but um, I'm keeping this out to remind me that I need to do my uh, injection, but, um, I guess that's it. I do my injection. I would do, like, a actual injection video. I've done it a couple times, um, just because I think it's really informative and cool, but, um, I'm not sure about this channel. Um, but yeah, when I do my testosterone injection, the empty needles go into this thing, which, once it's full, the cap gets put on here that you can't take off, um, and then you take this somewhere safe, to a hospital something where you can like drop it off um usually a clinic not like literally a hospital but uh there's a place where you can drop these off um that's pretty much it um underneath the cabinet i have a whole like i have a whole supply of these syringes the needles the alcohol pads and i mean i have a lot i, bu I buy it in bulk so um and it's actually not that expensive um but yeah that is my um, that's my tea box, that's what I call it, and of course, I have the outside decorated with stickers and my name on it. I've got, I was, uh, mutual friends with this author named Cheryl Rainfield, and she sent some stickers that I put on my box. Um, don't even ask about the My Little Pony stickers, I thought they'd be cute. Um, but you can get this kind of box at Walmart. Um, this is called an attache case. It's got, um, it's got a code that you, uh, that you set it up with. I think you can also change the code because, I mean, this is upside down, but that's a code relating to my, uh, a specific date that is no longer something in my life, so I should probably change that. Um, I don't know if you can change the, uh, code. You probably could. Um, but yeah, you can get one of these at Walmart, you can get these at Walmart, and um, this BD, uh, that like supply store, uh, BD, and that like, um, that logo, I think that's what my needles are. Let me find out. Um, nope, these are XL, okay. I know BD is like a distributor, and I, I think they sell this brand, but I, I think that's the website I went on last time uh, to order these bulk syringes. Um, I get these lure lock tip syringes, um, one milliliter. It just means that the needle gets screwed onto the top. You can see that there's a, a way to thread it there. Um, and then you get the corresponding needles with the lure lock end of it so that when you take them, you just screw them onto these. Um, I mean, diabetes like needles and other supplies are easy to come across so that's where you can like like that's why these are so like 
readily available because it's, it's not specifically for people on um, hormone therapy, though. There's also cis people on hormone therapy, so um, not that hard to get uh, syringes and needles. Um, I used to buy them from my local pharmacy. They used to have them available. Um, so that's also an option, and I think I did them like a, like a quarter like a quarter a pop, like 25 cents a pop uh, for these needles and syringes. But that was also a local pharmacy. They may have been just giving me a discount, um, especially since I was like a member there. But yeah, so that's my tea box um, with all my supplies in it. It hasn't been refilled in a while. Um, I'll be honest, I've been off tea for quite some time because I need to go see a doctor. Um, I need to get set up with a new doctor and I haven't gotten my medical card in the mail yet. So um, lots of stuff happening. Um, <laughs> sorry. I could be, I could put the phone up to the mirror and vlog that way. I just like, I don't look the best right now. I just figured I'd give a super quick tour of this. Um, I, it just says like filler content. I don't know. Um, I hope everyone's being safe. Um, and I hope everyone's enjoying the channel so far. I'm having a lot of fun, uh, making content for it. I just wish I could be doing more, but just life gets in the way, I guess. Uh, but let me know if you want to see any more, like, little vlogs where I, like, talk about, I don't know, anything at all or show off something that I have, something that I do. Um, I might do an injection video, like, talk about, like, how I do, uh, my testosterone injection, but I may save that for, like, a specific kind of series that I'm working on, um, where it's going to be, I mean, it, it, the injection stuff is not 18 plus, but I'm, I'm hoping to do an 18 plus series on this channel, uh, that I upload every month, but, um, I have to work on that first. <laughs> um, but yeah, anyway, uh, I'm signing off for now. Uh, see you later. That's a weird wave. There we go. <laughs> see you later. <laughs>